Hey guys, and welcome on into today's NBA pick video play of the day for November 8th, 2017. To get all of our NBA plays, you can check those out over at stumpthespread.com, linked down in the video description, and be sure to click that subscribe button on our YouTube channel. So heading into this one, we're going to be talking about the Miami Heat versus the Phoenix Suns and who we feel has the better edge here against the spread. The road team today, Miami, coming in as about five and a half point favorites. Neither of these teams have a great record overall, but I would say the Heat are certainly the bigger disappointment based on expectations. Coming into the year right now, the Heat stand just 4-6 and six overall in comparison to the Suns, who are 4-7 and seven overall. But the Suns, they didn't have any expectations coming into this year. So just the fact that there are only three games under 500 is at least something for this group to build around, especially given uh, the early season drama and uh, turmoil and changes that they've made. Uh, thus far, just 10 to 11 games into the year. But starting with the road team, the Heat, this is their fourth straight road game in a row. And certainly fatigue uh, could play a game here today for the Heat and be a factor, uh, especially going against a team that likes to play fast up and down. Uh, the Heat could have a tough time keeping pace, although it is a more manageable opponent than what the Heat have been going against as of late. To start this road trip, they felled the Nuggets in a close contest. Then they beat the Clippers in a game where the Heat got a huge lead, and then they fell apart in the fourth quarter before winning by just three points. And then in their last outing, they were actually able to dictate the pace a bit against Golden State. It was a much lower scoring game than we typically see out of the Warriors, but the Heat weren't able to do much themselves on the offensive end as they went on to lose that one by a final of 80 to 97 as Golden State went on to even cover that 15 point spread in a lower scoring game, which is generally a bit tougher to do. But the Heat, they're a team, they like to rely more on their defense. They rank just 25th in the NBA in scoring average, a bit more respectable 12th in total team defense with their plus minus on the year right now at about minus two points overall. The Heat, they were the hottest team in the Eastern Conference throughout the second half of last year. Uh, we didn't think that that was going to be a long-term uh, trend for this group. They don't necessarily have the star power to hold up that kind of result, but certainly a team nonetheless that we expect to make a potential postseason push this season. They have talented guys like Goran Dragic, uh, Hassan Whiteside, and just some other uh, solid pieces to build around and playing in a weaker, weaker Eastern Conference. The Heat will certainly get their chance to maybe get about a 6-7 to seven seed. Uh, maybe the high-end ceiling for them would be a 4 or 5 seed. But obviously, we still have a long way to go and a lot of basketball yet to be played to see where this group ends up by season's end. Comparing them over to the Suns, this is a young team. They were finally able to rid themselves of the Eric Bledsoe situation. I think that's a weight that's going to be lifted off the shoulders of this Suns group. Also, they've made a head coaching change early on this year at 4-7 and seven overall. It hasn't been completely disastrous for the Suns. They have suffered their fair share of convincing uh, defeats, but they've also picked up some wins along the way. Recently, uh, they just got off of a five-game road trip where they were able to win actually on the road against the Nets and Wizards over in the Eastern Conference. They're coming off back-to-back -back losses against the Knicks on the road and Spurs, but this group should be happy to get back to their home court and a chance to maybe potentially get another win on the board. The Suns, they like to play a whole lot faster than the Heat. They rank 16th in the NBA in scoring average, 6th in rebounds, and defensively, that's where they've had their issues. 29th in the NBA in total team defense, but Going against potentially a fatigued opponent today who's continuing their road trip, the Suns could get out, run, uh, maybe outpace the Heat and give themselves a puncher's chance at maybe going on to win this one on their home court. So to give our play on who we think has the better betting edge, we're going to side with the home team today, the Phoenix Suns, getting those five and a half points. We don't like Miami's offense all that much in a situation like this going on the road against a faster paced team and considering it's their fourth straight road game fatigue is something we're really worried about here uh, during this road trip here for Miami just scoring 80 points in their last outing not looking tremendous offensively so again we're going to side with the home team today taking the Phoenix Suns getting those points as our NBA video play for today and again guys to get all of our NBA picks you can check those out over at stumpthespread.com link down in the video description be sure to click that subscribe button on our YouTube channel thanks for stopping on in we hope to see you in future videos bye